It's one of the worst cases the district attorney says he has ever seen. A Syracuse man kidnapped and tortured over a laptop. As News Channel 9's Iris St. Moran tells us, the DA is making this case a top priority. It was at this home on 304 Merriman Avenue in Syracuse, where Onondaga County District Attorney Bill Fitzpatrick says a 26-year-old man who has some mental challenges was tortured after being kidnapped. A strong arm bullying, knife point, uh, physical threats, mental intimidation, having him call his mother to say goodbye, uh, that he would never see her again, uh, a BB gun, uh, a BB gun pellet, uh, lodged within millimeters of his aorta, which uh, would have killed him. The motive? He says some individuals thought he ripped them off for a laptop. From April 21st to April 24th, he was here. His mother and friend reported him missing. It's a miracle he's alive. A number of people have been charged in a five-count indictment. For two counts of kidnapping, Deshaun Adams, Hunter Armstrong, mother and daughter Rita Duckworth, and Renee Dolson, and Rahim Williams. They've also been indicted on two counts of assault and robbery. Quincy Williams, an additional person, was indicted on only one count of assault and robbery. One other person's name has been redacted. I, I don't know that in recent memory I have seen a case with such combined brutality against a, uh, a vulnerable individual. Uh, you know, he... He posed no threat to anybody. Uh, Fitzpatrick says the victim is recovering from his injuries and will likely have PTSD from the ordeal. In Syracuse, Iris St. Moran, News Channel 9. And Bill Fitzpatrick says the people charged with kidnapping could face life in prison if convicted.